from Smart and Bain. Jackson is out there with Bismack Biombo. And it's Morant in at the point. Always except. Here's Vassell. Mbanyama. Mbanyama on the follow. Knocks it loose. Morant with the steal. And here we go. Fast break and Morant's got it. Two points. That one goes. Boy. All you'll see in the NBA, but hard to argue that pick wasn't illegal. It's often a tough call that can go either way, but I agree with you on that one. Now here's Morant. If you're just tuning in, we played about two and a half minutes here in the first. Takes the 13-footer, and he hits the jumper for two. Here's Vassell. No good with the triple. And it's Jackson with the ball, bringing it up for Memphis. It's Morant with the drop. And another basket for Memphis. Good way to start. This Jones is checked in for San Antonio. Now, here's Vassell. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. have had not too many coaches last decades anymore. Here's West, following the basket by John Morant. Basket, good. That's nice work, stopping short of the rim. Just ask to Roddy. Order number two, around three minutes gone by. Biombo, no luck. Spurs trail by six. Inside, here's Osman. The basket is good off the assist from Graham. Osman's got his second bucket. Good ball movement from Devontae Graham, noticing the wide open teammate and getting it to him. And in the second quarter, a little under three and a half minutes played already. Just five to shoot. Puts up a deep three. Roddy no good. I'm not sure if anyone on the team has the green light from there. Definitely not him. It's the kind of shot that gives Hero Ball a bad name and causes your coach to consider another line of work. And the Grizzlies leading by four. It's Morant with the drop. Count that one. Morant's got four points this quarter. Okay, check out the handles of John Morant. Wow, what a crafty player. Here's Graham. And he lays it straight in. And those are the kind of nice inside. Bain and Jackson. And it's beyond that at the five. And that's the group for Taylor Jenkins. As we begin the second half. Efficient from range. Desmond came into the league with a sharp three-point shot. And now we've got some time to check in from the sidelines. You got for us, D.A.? Thank you, Kevin. Now the Grizzlies' backcourt is in the conversation for the best starting backcourt in the league. Desmond Bain says Ja is obviously the focus, and that's why I feel like we're a good combo. If they want to sell out on him and pack in the paint, and that leaves me open in the perimeter to do high damage. Kevin, back to you. And he does a lot of damage. David, thanks. A great tandem indeed. Now, Morant. After Kelvin Johnson missed from long range. It's been the John Morant show all night. What a competitor. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. Here's Branham. No scoring in this one. Passes it to Sohan. Just four to shoot. The three from Johnson. And Bain pulls it down. And the Grizzlies leading by nine. Shoots over Vassell. And the Grizzlies tack on two more. Stepping in. Bain is automatic from that area. And the pass to Wembanyama. And here is Johnson. Pass to Sohan. Here's Branham. Johnson outside. Johnson missing again. 
for Memphis. They've gone three of three from the field since halftime. And taken away by Johnson. Here's Branham. Pass to Johnson. Shot clock at six. Here's Sohan. And the shot is long. That's a good opportunity, but he needs to go up a little stronger, in my opinion. And you look at how Kelton Johnson has evolved. He is now a prime time scorer. One big difference these days. He gets himself to the free throw line. He's not just settling, he's attacking. This is it to Vassell. And he gets the whistle for the three second call. And when you're trying to cut into a lead, you can ill afford mistakes like that. You know what it is, a lack of concentration. That's a momentum killer. San Antonio making a switch here. Wesley's checked in. And now we're three minutes into the third quarter of play. Here's Roddy, covered by Johnson. They grab their own miss, Tillman. And good work on the boards. They pick up the second chance points. Tillman's got the lead up to 13 now for the Grizzlies. For San Antonio, they've gone 0-4 from the field in the second half. Yet to find the mark. The pass to Wembanyama. Will it go? Six to shoot. Can't hit that one. And so it's Smart who brings up the ball for the Memphis Grizzlies. This is the most they've led by, 13 points. Here's Conshaw. That one doesn't go. Good D by Johnson. San Antonio's getting blank from three-point land so far in the third. Still 0 for 3. Vazell, the pass to Johnson. It's rebounded by Memphis. One fifty-six left to play in the third. Bain with the buckets. I love that they're continuing to attack despite being up big. I'm impressed with their intensity tonight. Spurs trail by 10 on the court for San Antonio. The guard pair are Jones and Vassell. The forwards for him, Johnson and Sohan. And it's Wembanyama in at center. Now here's Jones. Five to shoot. And there's Johnson. That's good on the assist by Joe. Johnson's got the first field goal of the fourth quarter here for San Antonio. Morant passes to Williams. Memphis moving it around. Pass to Jackson. The rebound by Victor Wembenyama. And so Wembenyama will bring it up for the San Antonio Spurs. Eight-point game. Great pass to set up the lay-in. Good discipline from Fasale. Moving the ball instead of waiting for his shot to show up. We're just over a minute into this final quarter of play. And the Spurs making a change here. Branham's checked in. Into the lineup for the Spurs. And it's the Grizzlies with the ball. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Five on the clock. Takes the 13-footer. Jackson misses. Spurs trailed by six. We've gone about a minute and a half into the fourth quarter. And 153 left in the fourth quarter. Here's Branham. And the rebound by Jaron Jackson. Jackson's got six rebounds in the game. Smart gets to Moran. Good and Smart gets the assist. Smart's got his fourth assist in this one. Tremendous effort from John Moran, letting his team know they can rely on him. Here's Wembenyama. And there it is for him. 
Ben Banyama has got seven points for the quarter. He got the ball in perfect position, went up over the smaller defender, and laid it in for a big bucket. And Jackson throws it down home. Big moment. So it's Memphis picking up the win. Some good moments throughout this one, but they have the clear advantage down 